Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's currently 6 o'clock p.m. <sighs> um, right now I've got a video editing. I've got footage for another video that I will have to do later after this one's done exporting. This is the one that I need to get up today and then this one's going to be tomorrow's video. But I've got to go out there with her if you guys can see her. Let me fix the screen thing here. So. If it'll focus. Ella. Hi. <laughs> so she's out there eating right now. Um, and I can see her better normally. I think she's just slouched down right now. Um, so I'm gonna have, like, I need to get out there with her, obviously. There we go. Um, but I wanted to get my video edited because I was gonna do it today when she was napping, and then Tim was on the computer. He, like, always seems to be on the computer when I need to be, so I ran in here real quick, but, like, positioned her so I could see her and gave her, like, her dinner-ish. Um, it's not quite dinner yet. It's more of a snack today. Um, so she's got that and then she's been out there for like 10 minutes by herself. Um, it, she seems to eat better when I'm not out there, but I need to get out there. Um, I gotta cut my nails. I was gonna do it earlier, but my nails are getting pretty long. I don't know if you guys are even gonna be able to tell. Kind of. Um, I need to cut my nails. And then also I've been having this issue. I don't know if you guys can even see it. You can probably see it better on this thumb. See how it, like right here it rips. Uh, it gets like that on both of my thumbs. I'm not sure why. And it rips really high up onto like my nail bed. Like this one, it's like three or like a third of the way up my nail and that's, that's got hard to cut it off like that. So I just have to like keep them short and filed. Um, like I have to cut it as short as I can without making it so my thumb sore and then I have to file the like tear. I don't know why it's doing that. Um, it's been doing that since I had her, pretty much. Um, I think it did it a couple of times before I had her, like when I was pregnant with her. But ever since having her, it's been like that a lot more. Um, and I do take prenatals, so I don't know. I don't, I have no idea. But this video is almost done exported, exporting, exporting, and then... <sighs> I'll probably wait till she's done eating. I'll bring her in here, let her play around in here a little bit, and then I'll edit and upload the other video, or, you know, edit and upload this video. I do. Anyways, I need to get out there with her. All right, so this is how dinner is looking as of right now. Um, so I was gonna cook last night, and Tim told me he wanted the, like, creamy ranch chops that I usually make, so. I didn't have time to make those after he told me because he didn't, like he got yeah. home, it was like quarter to nine. And they have to slow cook for at least four hours. So I just didn't have time or else I wouldn't have been done until like midnight. Actually probably closer to one o'clock. So scratch that. He told me just to make sandwiches. Um, I could make the ranch chops tonight. <laughs> However, I went to make them this morning realized I didn't have any of my ranch packets um so what I mean by ranch packet if you guys aren't familiar they are like it's like ranch dressing that you can make only it's in like a packet like you could get taco seasoning it's like that um and you mix it with like milk and other stuff I don't remember exactly what you have to mix it with, but you mix it and you can make your own ranch dressing. Um, 
I usually put that, a can of cream of chicken, and a can of cream of mushroom into the slow cooker with some pork chops. And it's called creamy ranch chops. After six hours slow cooking on like high or eight hours on low, they usually just fall apart and it's so good. Um, but I didn't have any of the ranch packet and so I improvised and just used like normal ranch. Um, I was like, you know what, I'm gonna mix it up a little bit and I added a little bit of Parmesan in and then I'm gonna add some more once it's like cooked down and everything and I'm just about ready to like pull it out. Um, so that's the game plan. Who closes a cereal box like this? Why? Oh my gosh. Tim got some tricks this morning and apparently didn't close it normally. Like who closes it like that? Anyways. So yeah, that is what the meal plan is for dinner tonight. I'll probably make some pierogies and some corn to go with it. But, oh, excuse me, I do need to go to the store tomorrow, tomorrow Sunday. I need to go to the store tomorrow at the latest because I need to get a few things for dinner next week and for the next couple of weeks. Just a few things that I overlooked when meal planning, like, uh, a bag of frozen mixed veggies I need for a pot pie recipe, stuff like that. So I need to get that all done. But as of right now, my nose is like all jacked up if you guys can't hear. And it's like constantly dripping. So I will see you guys all in a bit. Hopefully I can get this all figured out. Have kids, they said. My daughter was currently just yelling at me, telling me to move because her dinner wasn't getting done fast enough. Are you telling mommy to move it? No. You say no, but I think you are. Her current favorite thing to do is sit on shoes. <laughs> Not a clue why, but we roll with it. <clears throat> but I guess I better get her dinner done. <laughs> 